Yeah, so I played down there two years. Mark Cuban, great guy. Um, Mark Cuban, he actually, you know, he, I like Mark Cuban. I don't know him personally, but I like yeah. you. That's from what I see. He cool. He cool. He helped me a lot. You know, my pro post NBA career, man. He's actually one of the one of the guys who actually guided me and helped me out with some things. You know, saying whenever I had ideas. I didn't have to go to Shark Tank. I'll go right to him. He was like, yeah. hey, yo, think of this. <laughs> That's where I watch him, man, Shark Tank. Yeah, he was like, nah, man, don't do that one. <laughs> All right, man. Yeah. Like, he's blowing his email up. Like, yo, what's up with the, um, what about this one? <laughs> Three reasons why it ain't going to work. I was like, oh, OK. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, then he, he then I, I told him about my, my youth basketball program. Obviously, he was like, oh, yeah, that's, that's a good one. And, um, you know, so, yeah, I'm Mark Cuban. It's good. Uh, always uh you know especially like in the tech space you know because we're pretty much all in somehow in technology at this point you know and uh being able to tell people that i i work with mark cuban and, and learn from mark cuban it always kind of gave me a little leverage you know yeah people you know it's kind of like oh my god it's mark cuban you know <laughs> but uh yeah he, he was cool i used to always sit on a plane with him but we had to sign seats on the, on the way games we mm-hmm. fly out and my whole rookie year, you know, I was I sat by him. That was my assigned seat. So oh, that was a good assigned seat. <laughs> yeah. He took a liking to me though. Because I, I never I never talked about basketball. I was always interested in like <laughs> you know the, the, the entrepreneurial side of things. Business, yeah. Yeah. I used to always ask questions. Like, but man, yo, we used to be on the phone. He used to be on his phone. I don't remember the old phones, the sidekicks. Phones. <laughs> Over sidekicks. Class. <laughs> Two way pager, and he used to be on it. I'm just like, yo, we don't even have a signal, man. What are you writing? Who are you writing to? He's like, well, I'm writing. I'm saving all. I'm writing all of my emails, all my reply emails. So by the time I, you know, we land, they'd be writing my folder. I send them all out. So he was basically showing me how to be efficient, even when you, you know what I'm saying? When you, when you can't actually communicate with anybody, he was like, hey, I'm still getting something done. I'm still able to. You know, um, communicate with everybody. So, you know, I just wrote 20 emails. So all I got to do is go into my draft yeah. folder, send them out, yeah. boom. And he's a billionaire, so he, you know, he don't have a lot of time. So he's able to be a time efficient, and that that showed me a lot at that point in time. I feel like I, I took that and ran with it because it's made me so much more punctual and efficient just by having a mentality. 